because even though on paper the Astros are still a very awesome yeah, team. Yeah, they should they should run through the AL West. Still. Yeah, still. And I just feel like this if these players are all lumped together and cheating, mm-hmm. I would just say I would. It, we're we're gonna anywhere we go. We're gonna have that. <laughs> we attention. ride together. We die and, together. And you figure how Bad many, boys how for many life. players are actually being forgiving over any of this? We're getting like Trout never speaks to anybody about anything, and he's voicing his opinion. Yeah. Obviously, Cody Bellinger yeah. with his lovely my speech. guy started it all. And uh, <laughs> but yeah, so I believe the Astros will stick together. I don't think they'll they'll separate at just because of. Now they're like you said. We're in it together. We're we ride and die. Yeah, we, yeah we're we're here. So the thing about that, and here's my fear, right? My fear is that because they are such a good team, that they end up running the table, and then they end up back in the World Series. Which if they end up back in the World Series, this will be the biggest. Like I feel like this will be the biggest blow to baseball since probably like the '94 strike, because that then it means that not only did the uh not only did, did the cheating not matter not only did everything we did not matter but they still beat everybody to get back in this position now they gotta lose it's literally like a i i, I attribute it to like wrestling where like it's like literally like the iron sheik versus hulk hogan like the iron sheik is like built as like this crazy he's from a different country and he's bad and we have this all-american hero he should stop him and that's the kind of like the Astros are, are the Iron Sheik. And it's like, they can't come back. They can't because they've done all this stuff. We know they do it. Like, they can't make it back here. But then just imagine, I feel like that would honestly be, like, the most watched World Series. Because everyone's... And that's what I was going to say. With how the commissioner, his all his reports and all his press conferences and all this, do you feel like any of this was manufactured to draw in ratings, to make it, hey... We have to, we we need to draw in ratings. To get up. So Look. it's like as a conspiracy theorist, like, is this a legit thing or is this to hey we Jerry Springer this a little and yeah. now we're gonna run with it. That's why he did the punishments the way he did it because, like for us baseball, um at least during the postseason baseball, uh, well, the ratings have been on the rise. However, everyone says that baseball is a is a quote unquote dying sport because there's no new blood. There's no uh, like the younger kids don't want to play baseball. They want to play football or basketball or whatever. Um, so that's a that's a good theory that he just decided. You know what? Let's because it's funny because on social media, the baseball is getting the most talk I think exactly. ever. Exactly, and also people and, are saying like this is gonna be the and, best baseball season and if ever. You notice like. The, Watching the highlights or watching any of the spring training games, some of these teams are just like they're packed. You're just right. like, what? No, what? <laughs> like, but obviously, the some of the teams are still like, oh, hey, right, hey, like we're but... in Tampa Bay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, I never count Tampa Bay out. They have like they have players that you never even heard of, and they yes. still make it, which I'm like, yes. what? Um, but uh, shout out to G uh, Man, man. <laughs> um, uh. Let's just let's kind of let's table this for right now. So I feel like it's going to be an interesting season with that team. They will have they'll, they'll, I feel like they're going to be like the Cowboys of the uh, of, of baseball where it's like it's all this controversy, but you got to watch them because yep. you don't know what's going to happen. You don't know what fight's going to break out. You don't know whatever. So it's going to be interesting.